Blackboard Collaborate Setup Basic Tutorial. So in this tutorial we're going to look at the very basics of how do we get a Collaborate room inside of our course. So to do this I'm just going to pop into my development course. Of course you'd be going into your regular course. From here what we need to do is we need to have an area that we're going to have the Collaborate available um, to, to your students and to yourself. And this can be any content area. So this could be, you know, a learning module, um, folders, could be, like, in any content area. So we could go ahead and we could go inside of um, any learning module that we'd want, we could set that up. Another way that we could do it is we could make it a menu item. And uh, for this demonstration, I think I'll go ahead and do that. So I'm just going to go ahead and, and create a content area, and I'm going to call this I don't know, Video Discussions and I'm going to make this available to all users. Again, not a necessary step. You could be inside of a learning module or something like that and, and deploy it there, but the point is, is that you need a content area to do this in. So I'm just going to go ahead and go into Video Discussions, and what I want to do is set up the tool, a link to um, the discussion room. So I'm going to go to Tools, and I'm going to go down to Blackboard Collaborate. So again, inside of a content area, Tools, Blackboard, Collaborate, and I'm going to give it a click. And what this is going to do is going to give me an option uh, of several different ways that I want to do this. For this basic tutorial, we're not going to explore all of the options. We're just going to um, set up a very basic room. So what we're going to do is instead of launching room, we're going to click Add a Link. So we click Add Link, and it's going to say, where do I want this link to be? And it's going to be inside of Video Discussions. And we could call it, you know, whatever we want. I'm just going to leave the default right here. Um, there are uh, different options that we can look at inside of here, some date restrictions and things like that. But for this case, I'm just going to go ahead and save. I'm going to leave the defaults on everything. And now it is inside of Video Discussions. So let me go ahead and click on Video Discussions and here it is. So if I'm a student and I'm looking to pop inside of here, if I give that a click, it's, it's going to bring up the launcher and, and I'm going to go. So right here I'd say uh, launch the room and that's how I'd get in there. So again the, the basic steps are a content collection area uh, or a content area and then you want to go to tools and click on that Blackboard Collaborate and pop in. Um, inside of here you also have the option of using a phone if you're going to call in um, you can use that as well and if not you click launch room and that's how how you go to it from there so this tutorial was the basic setups so we didn't do any configuration we just used all the defaults but now uh, blackboard collaborate is up and running i hope this helps